what is going on you guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new and you've never seen my face before hi my name is ash and this is my channel living ash first things first i have not filmed in days um <laughs> i have been so busy trying to graduate college this is my last two weeks of my internship which means i will be graduating with my bachelor's degree um on april 29th that's my graduation date so stay tuned for some pictures i'm taking grad photos on saturday so it's gonna be really fun and i'm looking forward to it so i've been really really busy planning that and i've had to push my youtube videos to the side unwillingly and i hate that but after i graduate you guys it's about to be like a new year new me in a sense like a new journey new chapter begins and i'm very excited and i hope that you guys stay tuned for that and if you're new let me know in the comments down below and subscribe because you're gonna want to be here for the journey i promise i have an incredibly huge empties video for you guys and it's huge i've had so many people from months ago months now ask me for an empties video so i want to show you guys the products i will and will not be buying ever again <laughs> um and yeah i'm not gonna go through everyone in detail because we'd be here for 10 years but i will be telling you if it's a yes to buy again or if it's a no and it's a huge huge haul and i have it in this ulta box from when i got my tree hit scrubs online so i guess the first thing let me i don't know what i'm gonna do with this box maybe i'll put it right here <laughs> hold on but let's go through these empties because i know so many of you guys like empties videos the first thing just picking things at random was this this is the dove exfoliating body polish this is the kiwi seeds one i think it is yeah it's like a kiwi and aloe yep kiwi and cool aloe this is an absolute gem i absolutely love this one i love it it's one of my favorite ones it's very refreshing it's very nice totally recommend and you can find this on amazon or in burlington i believe but that was last week because burlington gets kind of crazy when people mention you know you can get a product there the next thing i finished is my lovely lovely dr teal's moisturizing bath and body oil 100 percent would repurchase i'm obsessed with it it has sweet almond oil cocoa butter and jojoba oil ew it literally smashed like one on my lip and my chin okay it's just oil though um so i do love this a lot i actually think out of like all my oils this is one of my favorites this was something i used morning and night so highly recommend you can find this in big lots walmart anywhere where they really have like dr teal's products so 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 good love it next thing i finished up is this i've been obsessed with ogx body wash this is the shea soft and smooth body wash decadent aroma completely done i still have a huge body lotion left of this but i don't know if i'll repurchase i feel like the lather isn't all that great in my opinion um but the smell is absolutely amazing oh, the smell i feel like you cannot go wrong with this it's very very pretty and i don't know i may or may not purchase it if they have smaller bottles yes i would repurchase this one um i think you guys would really like it if you like that nice creamy vanilla note in a body wash um it really is described as a vanilla and a warm decadent frosted treat so highly recommend next up i finished a bath and body works body lotion which i love this is cotton blossom absolutely cotton blossom is like sea island cotton's almost twin sister which is now revamped as sea island shore or something cotton blossom is so 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 good like i don't know you guys try out cotton blossom um it has notes of cotton flower crisp air and soft musk obsessed oh i just got a sale how nice <laughs> um and my mercari link is down below i have some new items listed and um go check it out i also finished this nivea in shower body lotion 24 hour moisture i like this would i purchase again um i don't know it, it it's okay it's not like a must um i don't see this one that often though this like pink one what is this really it's argan oil with exfoliating pearls uh i definitely would probably get it again but is it like you need this no it just adds a little bit to your shower routine um this is also for normal to dry skin it exfoliates and it moisturizes it's a two-in-one um so you would apply this after cleansing on wet skin rinse off and go no need to wait no sticky feel nothing like that so yeah that's that another thing i finished is the dove brown sugar and coconut butter 
100%. I have another one, so I will be I will be repurchasing this over and over and over again. It is so good. This is if I make a video about the products I literally can't live without, this has got to be one of them. If you can get your hands on this, please do because I feel like this is going to be something that's like a limited edition body polish. I feel like they're going to play us like that. This is so good. I love the way it polishes my body. If I'm looking for a deeper, more profound scrub, this is definitely it. It's not as harsh as, you know, a tree hut scrub. It smells good. It feels good. This is the perfect addition to your body care routine. So definitely pick up this Dove Exfoliating Body Polish in the brown sugar and coconut butter. Must. Absolute must. I've used two of them up now. This is the second one I've used up and I'm obsessed. This. This isn't even empty, but... Um, I hate it. I absolutely hate it. Um, I don't recommend you guys buy this. I'm literally getting rid of it because I just don't like it at all. This is the Hemp Spun Sugar and Vanilla Bean Herbal Whipped Moisturizing Body Mousse. It's funny because my cousin also is into body care and fragrances like I am and she picked this up and she returned it. Um, I lost the receipt so I didn't even bother returning it. But this does not smell like a spun sugar or vanilla bean. It smells horrendous. It smells like cherries and I'm not even a big fan of cherry scents so absolutely not. I would never repurchase this i'm sorry hemp's is one of my favorite brands but this product in particular is not a not it's just a no nada no next i finish and you guys will see i finish a lot of body wash um i use the avino soothing body wash this is the camilla oat um it gently cleanses and helps preserve the skin um i like it it was the lather there's no lather at all um it kind of is super liquidy these are I think they should change the formula. It's very gentle though. I have to agree I feel like if you have sensitive skin, this would be very very non irritating But it, it just doesn't have it doesn't lather up very well. It doesn't lather up at all really and it just I Don't know. I feel like it could be better. I feel like the formula can be a bit better Hopefully they can improve it the scent on this. Let me see. Hold on this scent is okay it this i wouldn't repurchase i'm not gonna lie but there are other scents so if you do want to try those i haven't tried those this is the only one that i have um but i do think the thought behind this is right but it just isn't right yet so no i won't repurchase i finished a dove bar soap this is the cream oil absolutely love this i can't even remember where it is now i have another one in my shower now I can smell it. I love the scent. I love the cream oil. It's a beauty cream bar with Moroccan argan oil. Absolutely incredible. Um, I definitely would continue to repurchase these. You can find these in like El Presidente. You can find them in Big Lots, Burlington sometimes, Ross. Love the Dove cream oil bars. Oh, since we're on the topic of bar soaps, oh my gosh. So I actually didn't finish. I finished two of the bar soaps from Pears. This was the one I got in like El Presidente. You guys can check out that video where I went to like different like markets and things like that where you can find body care. And the Pears soap was in there. So good. Love Pears. This one is the Mint Extract. Absolutely love this. It's in the shower right now. So I did use two already. And this is, I'm on the third one. So the box has got to go but i had to show y'all in the empties video and i also finished up this brazilian gardenia and coconut milk from caress if you know me i absolutely love caress bar soaps come on camera are you kidding me the caress bar soaps are really really good and i love this and i also was able to find this in a liquid soap which you can find in walgreens um they have those but this smells so good. I love Caress. The lather, it lathers really well. So would we'll definitely repurchase that. In the shower, I'm currently using the Dettol Fresh Antibacterial. How I feel about it, I don't know. I feel like this kind of smells more so like a cleaner for your bathroom, not for your body. Um, but I love Dettol. <laughs> it's something that I just grew up on. So I have other scents that I haven't gotten into yet. I kind of wanted to use this one first. But I probably wouldn't get this specific scent again because I don't really like that lemony scent in my bar soaps. I kind of would not prefer that. And I picked up the Johnson's Baby Soap Bar. And would I get this again? I'm not gonna lie. No. I love the pink bar from Johnson. So Johnson's Baby Bar Soap in the pink. But this white one is okay. Like the scent is not what I really love. It's not a bad scent. It's just not my baby bar soap from Johnson's. And this is the baby soap, but it's just not what I want specifically. So I probably won't get this again. 
but it was nice to get in like a store that normally wouldn't you know that carries these things where i normally couldn't find in like a regular store so that was fun and i am currently using in the shower right now this is the velvet skin bar soap with wild orchid and sweet violet extract this is from shea moisture this bar is absolutely <sighs> incredibly big <laughs> that's it's a huge bar and i really like it because it has that rice water it's really cool because it's like a purple rice water bar soap which is cool and it's for dry delicate skin so yeah i'm still using it though so i can't really tell you if it's amazing but it is huge so if you like huge bar soaps this is it like for real i also finished up this caress black orchid and patchouli oil this is totally something i would buy again i love caress i love 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 caress i'm using the evenly gorgeous which i'm hearing is the exact same thing as the brown sugar um okay <laughs> so this one is the black organ patchouli oil to relax and recharge this was like my valentine's day get ready with me type of scent this is a very very beautiful body wash the floral essence of this body wash just gives me life so um totally recommend you pick this up would i like pick up 50 of them at once no because this will literally last you so long like this lasted me like a, like a month or no since february it's april now so it lasted me really really long i finished up my prized possession i finished the true blue spa shea butter vanilla almond absolutely would i buy it again 100 thousand percent i love this it is the lay it on thick this is the most moisturizing thing from bath and body works if they can come out with another line similar or just bring these back year round would be amazing the scent on this is good i used it with my johnson's almond oil every night and of course you know sometimes in the morning it's so moisturizing i have a couple of them i also have a few i believe are listed on mercari if you haven't been able to get them yourself but these are really good true blue spa if you've never heard of it from bath and body works and the best one in my opinion is this vanilla almond it is just fire like amazing amazing and i got this at a bath and body works outlet and i got them during some my annual sale in 2020 and body care day 2020 they were like five bucks so it wasn't bad but then you know they got more expensive during some annual sale which sucked but i mean they're so good i'd pay full price for this i'd even pay more than i'm supposed to for this because it's that good you guys if you've been watching me for a while you would know i have been completely like you know i just don't like coffee scented products i just i never liked it i like more sweet things i like more like perfumey things but i fell in love with this body wash and i i have to say to my subscribers who aren't really into coffee scented things i would say give this a chance in the shower like go home use it in the shower and see how it feels i love the way this feels on my body it feels so good on my skin i like it it's very creamy it gives me a creamy aroma and it also gives me a creamy feel on my body and it's very moisturizing so highly recommend you guys pick this up i have it in the body cream now so i use the body cream although the body cream i don't think lasts very long but that's okay because i use it to go to sleep so it's very very nice it's a coffee and coconut oil this is the ogx coconut coffee scrub and wash absolutely incredible i do have another one of these now so oh my gosh if this is something that calms me down it's so good and i'm just kind of sad that i just passed it up for so long and it is done so i'll be looking forward to opening up the pink one which i was like ew i don't like it and i'm gonna see if i like that one it's like the sea salt one so we'll try that out sadly i finished my love beauty and planet rose and almond oil shower oil so sad this is very very hard to find on tiktok i had a lot of people telling me that it's in their target it is not in any target near me this is one of the best shower oils i actually wasn't even into shower oils until i found this one of my favorite youtubers natural nisi actually showed this in one of her body care routines and since then i was just hooked and um yeah so natural nisi put me onto this and since then i had always been buying it and of course i shared it with you guys so yeah this is out guys and i would totally buy this again if i could get it again if you can find these please pick them up they're incredible another thing i finished up is this beautiful beautiful olay aromatic orchid okay very beautiful scented body wash absolutely incredible you guys can tell i love body wash and bar soaps 
so so pretty oh this is like what you want your body wash to smell like and it's so little and i got it in burlington i think for 2.99 best 2.99 i ever spent and it's in another language there's always someone in the comments who's able to tell me what language that is um but yeah totally recommend if you guys can find this even in the big um version pick it up now these lotions right here these are actually going to be going out of my collection um they're not empty but actually i've had them for so long and i just realized i never really gravitated towards these as much like i use a lot of my stuff but these are from the body shop um this is the mango this is sweet tenya and this is shea um i don't know what i'm gonna do with them just yet either i'm just gonna like not use them probably give them away or you know just call it quits with these they're just not what i want anymore um i got these way when i started my body care collection years ago so i just know it's like a declutter type of thing and i'm like eh, these are not it so i have mango sweetenia and shea and um these are the only thing that are kind of like full not full but like not completely empty that i'm showing you guys that i won't be having in my collection anymore hold on i don't know why this is in here but this will be listed on my mercari this is not an empty this is going to be for sale this is the fuji green tea from the body shop if you like the body shop this is a very very good lotion i have plenty of them so i decided i would list one on mercari in case anyone wanted to get this specific scent because i really like this one and i have a lot so i won't even use all of them next i finished up rain kiss leaves from one and only bath and body works i have another one so i'm happy about that green kiss leaves is an absolute gem if they bring this back for semi annual sale i will most definitely be purchasing it's crazy that even after washing out the bottles they still smell exactly like the lotion that was inside it is so so crazy um this is also uh not even an empty but i don't use this and i wouldn't sell this it's done this is the pond dry skin cream if you've been watching me for a while you know i use kills only on my face i only moisturize my face with one thing right now um and this is it i am open to trying new things but this is out guys i have not used this in so long since i changed up what i use on my face so i won't be using this anymore gotta get rid of it because it's just sitting there i also finished my toka this is the giletti giletta body wash i kind of wish i didn't finish this that fast because toka is really really good and this was only 2.99 um i got this in tj maxx this toka body wash my toka fragrance collection is growing so i would totally pick this up again there's a little bit left at the bottom but <laughs> i love toka so i should never finish up that fast but you know me i love to shower also finish this agave papaya sunset this my friends is just incredible love agave papaya sunset hopefully it comes back for sas this year i would love to see a revamped packaging even though i think the packaging on this is so 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 pretty and this also has notes of sugar de agave golden papaya dolce de leche coconut sands and exotic musk 100 percent love it my gosh oh this empties and I, I hope y'all know these empties are from months like months i don't do empties often so yeah so if you see anyone comment like oh my gosh she used all those it's over a period of time baby like relax but yeah this is from a while ago this is my johnson's almond oil i love the johnson's almond oil you guys 100 percent. please pick this up a lot of people were having trouble finding it please pick it up you guys know i love it like you heard it here first ash loves the johnson's almond oil I finished the Dove Antibacterial Body Wash. It's so crazy because I haven't seen these things in so long. Um, totally recommend. I do recommend this more so in the bar soap because I love to use my bar soap as more of a base clean. So I'm going to probably recommend you guys buy this in a bar soap if you like bar soap. But in a liquid soap, it was just fine and I liked it. Also finished up one of these Yardley Body Wash. Um, this is the Lavender Rosemary Yardley Body Wash. They're kind of hard to find. Found mine in Big Lots, so I was blessed. So yeah, finished this up. Would I buy it again? Eh, let me see. Hold on. Probably. It smells like fresh washed clothes. Hmm. Probably. I love collecting these things. I like things that are harder to find. So I probably would buy it again, but I have more. Like I always buy multiple of the same thing because I use my body wash so fast. So like body wash, I don't mind. Like lotion, I try not to buy too much because I don't get through my lotion as fast as my body wash. I used up the brown sugar and fig from Bath and Body Works. 
she out of here would i buy it again no i used to really like this scent and then i just fell out of love with it i just i couldn't even stand to put it on but it was so good it's fresh fig coconut milk and caramelized brown sugar and i love those scents i think i just got tired of it but i don't think i'd purchase it again but my nose always unlocks to new things or unlocks to something that it didn't like before so i might end up buying it again i don't know i use the tree hut vitamin c scrub love when i use up my scrubs you guys would i buy it again no i feel like it was okay like i mean i feel like i've fallen in love with different scrubs so no i probably wouldn't get the vitamin c scrub again unless you guys i found it in like marshall's or tj maxx for a very very low price but i already knew i was about to run into this <laughs> this is one of my favorite body wash ever this is the soft and pamper this has pineapple and lily aroma absolutely you guys know i've talked about these a lot on my channel the johnson's body wash these are incredible and if you can find the pineapple lily aroma like what i'm showing you excuse me my light is so rude this is an absolute must please pick it up it is so good i only have one left oh my gosh this is so 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 good so good please pick it up it's in burlington big lots and um online it's expensive so don't even try it so finished my johnson's baby lotion 100 percent would recommend you buying it i love it i love this powdery scent mm. Yes, this is in the little travel size, so yes, I did finish. And I just squeezed my finger inside. I finished up another in-shower body lotion from Nivea. Again, I would not purchase this again. It's not all, it's not all that. It wasn't my favorite thing, and I was kind of like over it. I had it for a while, so no, I wouldn't purchase again. This is the Pure Grace. This is a perfumed olive oil body scrub, which is so cool, but I would not purchase it again. I do have a second one that I haven't used yet, but this one, honestly, you guys, it wasn't all that. Like, I think if I was going to do a whole Pure Grace philosophy routine, yeah, this would perfectly, like, fit into it. But I wouldn't purchase it again. It was, like, 12 bucks in Marshalls. And it, I just feel like it didn't do anything for me, so I wouldn't get it again. I'm trying to hurry up, y'all. I'm going. I have, like, a few more in here. Like, this is crazy. This is really crazy. One of my favorite soaps. One of my absolute favorite soaps, Lakeside Afternoon. Please, somebody get this for me. This is the best. It smells like laundry. It smells like a fresh, clean detergent. Oh my gosh. This is perfect. This is just everything. Love this soap. If I can get this again, I hope I can stock up because it's that good. Um, it's just, it's sun soaked lavender. Bath and Body Works does so well with these fresh scents in that lavender. It has fresh rain and dockside breeze. Top tier hand soap. I also finished this hyaluronic acid body wash. I don't know. I feel like this is a little bit overhyped. I didn't like this scent much. And I just... I, I'd probably pick up one more. Maybe during a semi-annual sale. But I don't like this that much. I'm not gonna lie. I don't... Sorry, y'all. I don't like it that much. The body cream, different story. But the body wash is alright. Like, it just doesn't do much for me. I also finished this Nivea Frangipani in oil. I actually liked it i like the scent but it was okay it was it smells really good it smells really good but in terms of like washing my body eh, mediocre and i got this on amazon so i wouldn't buy this again and it was like 11 dollars. like girl no never again one thing that i absolutely love i fell in love with this little body wash this is hot cocoa and cream never in my 22 years of existence on this earth did i ever think i would like a cocoa and cream body wash because i just didn't i just never liked those type of scents but this if you guys can get hot cocoa and cream in this from bath and body works for the shower gel body care different story for me but this for a body wash was really really nice it was comforting especially at night i liked it next i finished this hemp's exotic green tea and asian pear this was actually okay. If I can get it again for a good price, I would buy it again. I think it was nice, but it's not a must. I don't think it does anything astronomical. Um, it does say condition and soften. It was nice, but it's not like amazing. You need to buy it right now type of vibe, you know? So yeah, Hemp's In Shower Hydrating Herbal Body Moisture. Um, yeah, this was probably like a six out of 10 for me. I finally finished my Brazilian Boom Boom Cream. It smells so freaking good mm, 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 mm. absolutely must have if you love body care you need yourself a brazilian boom boom cream 
top tier fire yes expensive but fire love it and the last thing in here is my dub nourishing care shower oil if you can find yourself one of these please 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 find it and keep it and cherish it because these are the best shower oils ever besides the one that i have from love beauty and planet they're the only two shower oils that i know of and if you guys know of any other shower oil please let me know please get this because it's not in walmart it's not in target it's i found this in burlington and i found another one in big lot so please try to get it um it is really really good i really love this and i can't believe i'm done but i'm blessed to have about two more in my collection so that makes me really really happy all right so i went ahead and packed everything back up in this box so i can get them out of my sight because that's another thing why i don't really like doing empties is because i hate to see things piling up i kind of like to just let it go as soon as i'm done but i love you guys so much and i did want to give you guys a little bit of a review on the products that i used up i am super tired <laughs> i actually am so proud of myself for actually filming this video right now because y'all i've been so busy and i just feel like you know i love doing what i do on youtube so being able to like film is super hard um when you're tired like having to film i should say because i'm tired i want to relax but then i don't feel relaxed and i don't get to come on here and talk to my you know supporters so i'm grateful for you guys if you stay to the end drop team ash in the comments with like any type of heart you want um it really is nice to see that you guys watch the whole thing like you guys actually care and want to know what the heck i got going on so i appreciate it and i hope to see you guys in the next video god bless you guys make sure you follow me on my social media so you guys can stay in contact with me even when i'm not posting on youtube so that'll all be in the description i'll see you guys in the next one i love you guys god bless bye guys